So, you know, I, I disagree with your premise. Uh, the, you know, it's clear, in 2015 we had a tragic accident, a woman was killed outside of, in fact a teacher was killed outside of Mont Pleasant High School. Um, a speeder ran her over, ran off, and she died. 2016, we submitted legislation to the State House um, to, um, to implement these traffic calming measures. 2017, we implemented and they came in in 2018. There's a real speed problem throughout the city, particularly around our schools. Now, we have all of the data, and it's clear. Ever since we've installed the cameras, the number of violations each week continues to go down and down and down and down. It's going to reach the point where we don't make enough revenue from them to even pay for the cost. But that's fine. It's an investment that we're making in kids' safety throughout the city. And I said this before, I'll say it again. For those folks that are particularly troubled by these cameras, slow down. I have not to answer my question. Mr. Lemire, I'm going to give you the, the more broad question. Do you support the speed cameras? And, well, if yes, why? If not, well, what would you do? I mean, I don't support them to, to, to the point that where the money goes. I live near a school, I live on Potters Avenue. I live at the corner of Potters and Ash Street, and that's when they tell you where the, where the speed camera is. But the speed camera is five more blocks down the street. They put three big signs up, I don't know what it costs, okay? To make everybody happy, because I like the speed cameras, but let's take that money and give it to the school department. Every speed camera in front of that school gets the money, okay? Send that money right back into the school. Okay, we don't need to take that money to, to, to buy red bikes. We don't need to take that money to do anything but what it has to go to the schools. Okay, let's, let's get music and art lessons for the kids, okay? That's what the camera should be for, okay? I just find it's very easy to take everybody's money because everybody's a lawbreaker, okay? I don't care who you are, okay? I'm not picking on the mayor, but if you go look at his van or the car he drives, he's got a little thing over his plate that is not going to have his picture taken, okay? We all know that right, trick. Right, Ms. Whitman, Ms. Whitman, speed cameras, do you support them? No, of and course not. I don't even know where to begin. I think it's a cheap and easy money grab. Let's, uh, let's restore the hundred or so policemen that have been laid off. We need them for a variety of reasons. Children shouldn't warm up to a speed camera, but they should warm up to a police person who has their best interest at heart. Uh, what else do I want to say about this? Oh yeah, what happened to I know a guy? He wanted to eliminate I know a guy. Well, he knew a guy who was his chief of staff and that chief of staff happens to be the lobbyist for the speed camera company. He's making $60,000 a year. I think that's unconscionable that the relationship exists. You know, get it from someone else. Certainly not from your former chief of staff.